Okay, everybody. So this is, uh, I guess, the fifth, fourth or fifth one. We had a few of these because they're 10 minutes out of whack. And we're recording the final run of our multi-tab players, uh, which is good. And all we have to do now, everything's set up. We're just going to run the optimizer and make sure it's working for us. So, uh, let's do it. Solve model. And here we go again. So what we've done is we carried over the sheet with the equal sign for the basically for the DraftKings section, right? We, then we copied and pasted over the rest of the information. We don't paste special values. We paste it just in as it is because we want the, uh, you know, the, 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 you know, the equals, et cetera. Everything's got to carry over. Then we're going to take the score. We're going to minus whatever amount you want. You might want a 10% decrease. You might want a 5%, one point. You might want a 50%. It's up to you. It doesn't matter. You can completely do anything you want. You are in absolute control of that. Uh, then we're going to, because this dumps the dives, as I called it, we get close to the score. So we're going to bring it in as close as we can, 51 to 53, on this particular incident. Uh, okay. Uh, let's see what we got here. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, it gave us the nine players. And again... Use the running backs for a flex. So whatever, under this particular model with these projections, it seems to think the running backs are offering the best deal. But you see now, let's look at the first lineup. We had A.J. Green, right? Let's just talk about the wide receivers. We had A.J. Green, Martavis Bryant, and Corey Davis. Over here, we have Antonio Brown, Sammy Watkins, and who else did it give us? It's got to be somebody in there. Corey Davis. So you see what I mean? It gives you different plays. It gives you a different lineup. Now, if you wanted to go to the next one, you click plus, and you do exactly what we just did here. You, you're going to take the score, right, of the, this score, which was, you know, I'll mark it yellow so you're clear on which one it is. You see it's, you want to take this score on the next sheet over, and you're going to put next to it the formula, this score, minus 0 0.5, 0 0.1, 1.5, whatever you want, and it's going to give you an answer. And like I said, to keep the solver honest and so it's not going low on you, get it, put it, give it something to work with that's close to that number. Uh, you know, and look, it gave me 51.4. It's actually pretty close to 51, but you see it was 53 on the last score. That was where the goal was. It went 51. Now, if I went over again, we would do minus 10% or whatever on this, and whatever that number was, I'd try to get close to it again, you know what I mean, just to give it something to work with between. That's why we did this score has to be less than or equal to this, or this score has to be greater than or equal to that, so it can play into the middle of it. All right? And you just keep going on that. That's, you can make 100 sheets like that if you want. When you're bored, plug away at it. Football season's another week or two, three weeks away. Chip away at it. You can make a, literally 50 different lineups. And you run each one, and it's going to give you a lineup each time you do it. Okay, just remember the only downside to this is it's relatively quick to do as you saw, but you do have to load the solver on each one of them. But you obviously you're going to become very proficient at loading solver, which isn't a bad thing, you know. Uh, okay, so that's my NFL spreadsheet for Google Sheets. I hope you liked it. If you have any other questions or you want to see something added to it, obviously let me know. Reach out. I'm Anadad71 on Twitter, and I can be reached here on YouTube. And thank you very much for watching this. I do appreciate your patience with me. I'm uh, new to making videos, so I'm not as proficient as some of the other guys, and I'm well aware of that. But I'm having a lot of fun. And uh, we're going to get to the MMA next. Somebody asked me if I do MMA, and, and yes, I will. I'll, I'll put up an MMA one. But I wanted to do football because it seems like the crowd might kind of lean a little more towards wanting that with that coming up. But definitely, brother, who asked me for the MMA, I, I'm aware you asked me, and you will get it. And thank you for the follow as well. Anybody who follows me, thank you very much. It's very, It uh, means a lot. Okay, Like, thumbs up, all that type of stuff. Okay, God bless. God bless Boston. And uh, Anna Dad 71 out.